So I've been having the chance to travel to Penang and experience the capabilities of the latest Oppo Reno4 Pro. The moment I got the phone, the design really attracted me with the anti-glare matte finish back design and the 3D curved super thin body that weighs just 161 gram. I really can't wait to explore Penang with this phone. During the two days one night Penang exploration with this smartphone really gave me tons of surprises especially on its camera capabilities. Color AI portrait mode, ultra steady mode 3.0, super slow mode, night mode. Right off the bat, it has the 48 megapixel camera sensor that can offer you a better dynamic range of images. First off, we went to Tan Jetty and I'm able to capture amazing shots. And a unique color AI mode that separates me with the colors of the background to make myself stand out of the picture. Next off, we went on horse riding at the countryside stables. And this is where the Ultra Steady Mode 3.0 come in place. You also get to stabilize your ultra wide angles and selfies as well. And another cool feature is that you get to shoot up to 960 frames per second. Isn't it stunning? Even the horse also agreed with me. And finally, the Night Mode 3.0 and Night Flare Portrait Mode. With this mode, I'm able to capture stunning night shots of Georgetown and bring up the portrait shots into a whole new level. The Night Mode doesn't just work during the night because it is good for low light situations like in the Dark Mansion as well. The only thing you always need to take note is the battery life. It will not last a full day with all the camera usage but because it has the 65W SuperWatt 2.0, just go to a cafe and plug it in and drink a cup of coffee. By the time you finish your coffee, it will already be fully charged. So to conclude my whole trip, with this Oppo Reno4 Pro, I really could say I'm impressed with the camera capabilities. And I replace this with my DSLR on my next travel vlogs.